They try to escape and they're suffocating and the gas is burning them. A horrible way for them to die. But do plants feel pain? No, they don't. Oh, you're already there. <laughs> this is wool. This yeah. is a wool industry. You did a good job of making it look bad too, so. Well, it's way worse than I could even show you on a TV screen. You know what this is? It's a gas chamber. 85% of the pigs in England, okay, cool. they kill them in these gas chambers. CO2 gas, you know the gas that's in um, cans of coke and that? Yeah, right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like fizzy and burns them. Why, why did they do that? They think it's more humane. It's not. No. Because there's camera footage showing it's not. The animals suffer a lot for us, don't they? Yeah. Why do you eat them? I don't eat fish. You don't eat animals? I don't eat fish, but I do eat animals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why don't you eat fish? Like you like fish? No. Just don't like the taste? Don't like the taste. Okay. So it's not like a fish feel pain, I don't want to harm them. It's none of that. No. Should be. But it should be. Yeah. Well, you, it could be. Yeah. The I'll power is in your hands. Like, you don't, everyone else can, they're going to pay for all of this, but you don't have to. Because you're affected by this. Oh, that's why I come up to you. I tell, oh, this, you've got a heart, I can tell. The way they do this stuff, I disagree, but obviously. Yeah. Me saying something to them is not going to make a difference unless everyone gets on board and says something. Then the government knows, you know what, there's too many of them. You can't stand it. But you know, when you have one, two, three, it doesn't really care. It doesn't really have an effect. But we can't stop all the murders happening either, but you don't, you don't say, oh, I'll still murder then because everyone else is going to. You know what I mean? That's a free range egg farm. Yeah. yeah. Eggs, milk, fish, wool. I know, I know. I'm vegetarian. I'm vegetarian. Stressing. Yeah, this is the egg industry. Really? Is it happening in England? This is England. Okay. You know what they do to the egg laying hens when they stop producing the eggs? They go to the slaughterhouse. Like the industry say it's humane. I'll just give you an idea of what they, what the, how they lie to people, you know what I mean? They lie to us a long time. Yeah, of course, they're trying to sell you bacon. They try to escape and they're suffocating and the gas is burning them. Oh. But yeah, they put them in this cage and dump them down into the gas, dark dungeon. It's a horrible way for them to die. Pigs are like uh, really intelligent animals. Very. Smarter than dogs. But I don't think like you matter more because you're smarter. I think you matter because you can suffer and experience the world, you know? You did a good job of making it look bad too, so. Well, it's way worse than I could even show you on a TV screen. Yeah. Being in there, being in a slaughterhouse, being in a factory farm is a lot worse than, it's, I've been in a few, yeah. actually. I've watched animals be slaughtered. Yep, I grew up with, on a farm with where we had animals like that. So. Yeah. They don't want to die, do they, the animals? They don't want to be killed. Yeah. I don't think any of us do. No, we don't. And not yeah. for something like a sandwich that you'll forget about or a burger. What do you think about it? Do you think it's cruel or what? Yeah, I think it's cruel. Yeah. It's cruel. Do you think the mothers care that their calf is being taken? Yeah, of course it is. They do. Then they go to the slaughterhouse when they don't produce any milk. About six years old, slaughterhouse, they get turned into burgers. You wouldn't donate money to me to harm an animal, would you? No, 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 no. But you donate money to these yeah, people to... Yeah, yeah. Same thing. Well, I'm, I'm not even understand you've got a clear point, but hopefully it does change. You know, hopefully, but I hardly doubt that. Do you know why I'm tell showing people? Uh, yeah, to be aware of it. Yeah. What would I gain out of people being aware of it? What, what would my goal be, do you think? I'm, I'm vegan, by the way. Oh, you're vegan? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, then that's the goal. You're already there. This is wool. This is a wool industry. And uh, most of the wool people wear comes from Australia. And they do something called mulesing where they snip off the tail and the, and the backside. But do plants feel pain? No, they don't. They react to stimuli in the environment. Plants are like intelligent biological computers. Like your phone reacts but there's no subject of a life inside the phone. I know the phone's not alive, but it doesn't matter if a tomato plant is alive. It matters if there's a subject in there that can experience the suffering. So when you see a, a pig, there's a subject of a life there. They experience that. You are a subject inside of you. What's your name? I'm Brad. Brad, that's your name, but inside you is a, someone having a subjective experience. That's a good point. And in a tomato plant, there is none. Do you know what a vegan is? Vegan. 
I do, I do, I do. I'm, I'm healthy. Leader. I know lots about that. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Vegans, uh, yeah. like we don't, we don't uh, use any of the products from any of these industries. Hi. Hello, how are you? I'm good, good. She She's gonna save you. Yeah. What I do? What? I'm teaching um, about the uh, vegetarian, oh, but yeah, no. the it's eggs. Heartbreaking. You yeah, should be I a don't vegan. Eat meat. But, I'm not vegan. But we I'm just vegan. tell her about the eggs and the yeah. milk as well. I know, I know, I know what vegan yeah. is all about. It's hard. No, it's hard for the animals. Of it's course. easy for us. No, of course. Compared. No, of course. Yeah. Of course. Of course. Yeah. All right. Bless you. Okay. Thank you. You vegan? No. Talk to me about it. Yeah, I, I tried. I tried to. But you tried to? Yeah. Why not? What What happened? But I tried to. But I, 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 I remember my environment is everyone like eat a lot of like meat. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. But yeah. I try not to eat like as much. As Lots, a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I really hate this. So. You hate? Yeah. So yeah. in your heart, you are a vegan. Yeah. But in your actions, no, you're not, not a vegan. That much. Yeah. No, yeah. yeah. Because if every time you went to eat an animal, yeah. you saw this. You would be a vegan. Yeah, I know, I know that. If you had to kill the animal, you know, you would be a vegan. In the dairy industry, they send them all to the slaughterhouse when they don't produce enough milk. In the egg industry, they send them all to the gas chamber when they don't produce enough eggs. All of these animals go to a slaughterhouse. Okay, and the yeah. slaughterhouse is one of the most horrible places on earth. I mean, I was a big meat eater myself, bro. I've been vegan nine years. Is it? And I was uh, on drugs, in gangs, violent all the time. Anyone can change. Yeah, it's just you have to make a decision. Yeah. You choose a path. Yeah. It was good. You're not putting violence, murdered animals in your body. Yeah. You know, they didn't want to die. They're getting their heads cut off. And people go and eat that. You know. It's... I used to work yeah. for large cosmetic companies. Uh -huh. The vegan companies. So yeah. I tried to cut down milk and eggs. Yeah, it's good. And, yeah. Because when you give them the money, you pay for that to happen to the animals. Oh, it's the egg industry, they get rid of the male chicks because they don't lay eggs actually, so they macerate them in a blender for, on their first day of life. Or they gas them, that's what the egg industry does. The females, they'll take them, de-beak them, put them in sheds. This is a great app, it's called Happy Cow. I'll show you what all the vegans, do you use Happy Cow? <laughs> but um, this one here is uh, challenge22.com. Free vegan help. Happy yeah, so when, whenever you want vegan food, mm -hmm. so let's go happy cow, right? And you see, look, Whoa. vegan, oh, that's great. and uh, exploit them. I can't believe it. Hello. I love you, I'm a massive fan. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm, I've always wanted, sorry guys, sorry to interrupt. I, I was He's the same, amazing. actually, I know you. Hello. I am, yeah. Love you, you totally you. vegan. Oh, really? Yeah. When? Uh, four years ago. Oh, oh, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> really nice to meet you. Great, yeah, See you, you in action, yeah. in person. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you for being vegan. How long have you been vegan yeah, six for? Six years. Six now. years. Wow, yeah. six years. A lot of people have been vegan for six years. Yeah. 2016. Yeah, yeah. it's Veganuary. Yeah. Veganuary. Ah, yeah. uh, yeah. bless Veganuary. And you stayed <laughs> vegan ever since? Yeah. yeah. So you rescue animals because of yeah, the I content that you've seen yeah. of mine. Uh, yeah, I'm thinking it was a pig, pig farm. There was a, it was oh, a pig sweeties. farm or something. Oh. And, it, and that's what it was. Yeah, well, yeah. It, I, was, I was in a pig farm yeah. and you it, saw it. Yeah, it was on, on YouTube. Yeah. Um, was it back in 2019? I think so. Was it a Pierce Morgan video? I think so, yeah. Yeah. It's good to meet people that I've influenced to go vegan because it is a big life shift actually people don't realize it's like the most important thing you do like you start like seeing the world differently it's like it's not just a change in your habits it's like a whole perspective shift you see things differently you see everything differently and it's like being woken up out of the matrix and if someone has like bestowed that information on you you kind of like would be really grateful to meet them and so one of my heroes Gary Orofsky I'd really love to meet him actually but so yeah, activism does work.